The Indiana Association of School Principals would like to announce the Academic Coaches of the Year for 2021. Congratulations to all of the finalists this year. We will begin with the finalists and the winner from the elementary division. First off, Valerie Bailey. Valerie coaches Spell Bowl at Riverside Intermediate in Plymouth, Indiana. Valerie has coached Spell Bowl for six years. Our next nominee is Megan Berry. Megan coaches Spell Bowl at Thorpe Creek Elementary in Fishers. Megan has coached Spell Bowl for three years and won one state championship and had one team place third at state. Our third nominee for the elementary division is Lisa Wright, the math bowl coach at Riverside Intermediate in Fishers, Indiana. Lisa has coached math bowl for six years and won five state championships and had one team finish second in the state. Congratulations to our Elementary Coach of the Year, Lisa Wright. I visited Riverside Elementary and presented her her award during her PLC. And I'm here to present an award to Lisa Wright. Cheers. They've won five state championships. Woo! Awesome. And okay, so one time they were runner up. <laughs> you know, we're such win, you know, can't all be winners, but you know, so five state championships and one runner up, which is awesome. And those statistics alone would have um, been good enough, really, for Academic Coach of the Year. But we also got some very nice words from Brent Farrell that said that Lisa instills the love and intrigue of mathematics in our young people, along with a fun-filled competitive spirit. <laughs> okay, now it sounds like somebody a little competitive. <laughs> My kind of girl. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Congratulations again to Lisa. Here are the finalists for the junior division. First off, we have Joe Garrity, academic Super Bowl and Spell Bowl coach at Central Catholic Junior Senior High School in Lafayette, Indiana. Joe has coached senior academic Super Bowl for eight years and junior academic Super Bowl for 14 years. And he has coached Spell Bowl for nine years. He has three academic Super Bowl state championships, two Spell Bowl state qualifiers, seven top 10 finishes in the English academic Super Bowl. Our next nominee, Tanner Givens, Spell Bowl Discovery Middle School in Granger. 
Tanner has coached Spell Bowl for three years, and in those years, he has two Spell Bowl state championships and top five finishes in all three years. And our last junior coach of the year nominee, Mindy Summers. Mindy has coached Spell Bowl and Academic Super Bowl at Central Middle School in Columbus. Spell Bowl and Super Bowl both for 13 years. He has one Spell Bowl state championship, two Academic Super Bowl state championships, five years the top 10 Spell Bowl finalist, three years the top 10 Academic Super Bowl finalist. Congratulations to our Junior Academic Coach of the Year, Mindy Summers. I visited Mindy's school to present her award. It was presented in front of a group of all of her students. as the middle school, the junior level academic coach of the year for the state of Indiana. We have a lovely plaque here recognizing her achievements and just something minor here. A, a nice fancy. little, yeah, fancy schmancy coach of the yes. year um, briefcase. There's also a coach keychain. So we have coach of the year for one year, but we love our coaches every year. So, you know, we give you the coach of the year keychain. Let me put this down here. Now, you all know Ms. Hunter's here. You know how amazing she is, which will explain why we chose her as academic coach of the year. But I would also like to give you some things that you may not know. <laughs> she has been coaching Spell Bowl for 13 years. I think longer than most of you have been alive. <laughs> she has been coaching Academic Super Bowl for 13 years. She has one Spell Bowl state championship team, two academic Super Bowl state championship teams, five years as the top 10 Spell Bowl finalists in this state, and three years the top 10 academic Super Bowl finalists. Now these statistics are good enough, I would think, for you know, anyone to be named academic coach of the year, but it goes beyond that. We have nominators who have a few things you know, to say about our coaches. So here's an excerpt from her nomination letter. It says, her students push themselves so hard, but they enjoy doing it. She loves her kids and would do anything for them. That relationship is why they would do anything for her. That combination will only fuel them to keep our success going for years to come. And those words were said by your principal, Jay Payne. Oh. And this is our person, Ms. Summers, as the Indiana Academic Coach of the Year. Let's give a round of applause. Congratulations again to Mindy. Here are the Senior Coach of the Year finalists for 2021. Cindy Albuchon, Spell Bowl and Academic Super Bowl, McCutcheon High School, Lafayette. Cindy has coached Academic Super Bowl for 24 years, Spell Bowl for 21 years, and Quiz Bowl for 19 years. She has two Academic Super Bowl state championships, four Spell Bowl state qualifiers, and seven Academic Super Bowl state qualifiers.
Our second nominee for the senior award is Peggy Grabowski, Spell Bowl and Academic Super Bowl, Terre Haute South High School. Peggy has coached Academic Super Bowl for 12 years and Spell Bowl for 20 years. She has one Academic Super Bowl state championship and two Spell Bowl state championships. Her teams have qualified for state Spell Bowl 18 consecutive years. And her teams have qualified for the Academic Super Bowl state championship seven times. Our third nominee for Senior Academic Coach of the Year is Heather Holman, Spell Bowl and Academic Super Bowl Tri-Central Middle High School in Sharpsville. Heather has coached Academic Super Bowl for 20 years and Spell Bowl for 24 years and led her team to the 2020 Spell Bowl State Championships. And the Senior Academic Coach of the Year is Cindy Abishan. I visited McCutcheon High School to present her award in front of her Spell Bowl team during her prep period. Of course, 24 years as an academic Super Bowl coach. Uh -huh. Lots of different themes over that time. Uh, yeah. Some of them I'm sure you loved more than others. <laughs> Personally, I had a few favorites and a few not so favorites, but it was always fun to go through all of that. 21 years as the Spell Bowl coach, four time state qualifier. I think a lot of you guys are involved in that particular process. 19 years as a Quiz Bowl coach. Yeah. Yeah, that's, that's a challenge too. And, you know, these statistics alone would, you know, get you right up there uh -huh. as academic coach of the year, but we also got a few nominations, and I want to read to you a little bit of that. So that I can start? Yes, yeah. here you go. <laughs> <laughs> so this first one, Ms. Abishan is, a passionate, is passionate about educating the mind, heart, and spirit, which is part of the reason why she's such an amazing coach. She sees the best in every student and is even able to transform students who may have thought that they were terrible spellers and readers into competitive state qualifiers. Throughout her more than 20 years of service to Spell Bowl and Academic Super Bowl, she has helped hundreds of students like me develop a lifelong love of learning and an appreciation for hard work and dedication. In my view, Ms. Abishan is a true leader and one of the finest educators in the state of Indiana. Oh. Thank you for honoring her legacy by considering her, oh. awarding her, the Academic Coach of the Year by Shelby Slager. Oh. Oh. <laughs> and then we have, after spending my high school, we didn't just get one nomination. Oh. Oh. <laughs> after spending oh. my high school years competing on several of McCutcheon's academic teams and having Ms. Abishan as a mentor, I'm confident that she's extremely deserving of this award. Not only is she amazing in the classroom, but she cares for her students and provides a safe, inclusive space. Cindy's most important quality was her empathy. She was there to support us through everything from competition anxiety to chemistry finals. To myself and many others, she is more than just a coach. She is a great friend, an advocate for people of all backgrounds and cultures, and a source of motivation that we didn't know we needed. <laughs> Ellie Atkins. With these types of nominations, it was no secret why we chose you as the 2021 Indiana Academic Coach of the Year. Congratulations. Congratulations again to all of our Academic Coaches of the Year. And special thanks to all of our Academic Coaches who make our programs possible. Your work challenging the students of Indiana is invaluable. Thank you to our sponsors, Purdue University and John W. Anderson Foundation, who help us provide these programs for students in the state of Indiana.